All right, we're going to do dilation again, but now a graph example. Oh my goodness, what do we do to the points? Um, okay, so the question might say something like, here's a graph of a, a beautiful looking triangle. We want to dilate this by a factor of something, and it'll say, what are the new points? It already gives us point A, B, and C, um, but let's pick a factor. Why don't we say a factor of four, okay? Dilate by... Well, wow, three, how's that? Dilate by a factor of three, okay. What happens when we dilate by a factor of three? Well, in the previous video, I showed how, you know, you took the, if you were gonna dilate by a factor of three, we just multiplied whatever the side was by, by three. We multiplied whatever this side was by the number three. Everything got multiplied by three. Well, it's not that different with this. If this is our point A, 1, 4, we're just going to multiply everything by 3 because we're dilating by a factor of 3. So what A prime will be, will be 1 times 3, comma, 4 times 3. Just like that. Which is, A prime is 3, 12. Okay? So that will be the new A point on your new triangle. Okay? Likewise, B, 1, 2, I mean, I don't have to go through the math here, but B prime will be, okay, 1 times 3 is 3, 2 times 3 is 6. There's B prime. And C, 3, 2. C prime will be 3 times 3 is 9. That's a funny looking bracket. And 2 times 3 is 6. So what we've got, we didn't even have to draw a picture. All we did is take our points and understand that when we are dilating by a factor of whatever it is, all we have to do is multiply those individual coordinates like this to get to our new coordinates. Ta-da! There you are. It's really just that easy. So what would that look like on a graph? Well, this should all be reviewed by now. Plotting points from the previous video. Well, um, okay, 3 and 12. 3 and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, so we're way up here somewhere. Okay, so there's a point 312, um, 36, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 9, 6. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, so I've got my three points on my x and y axis here. Uh, I'll just clear up some space here. So before we had this little tiny triangle here, tucked in nice and small, now we've got this triangle out here, right? This is our new graph, right? So before we were at this, before we were here, we dilate, dilate this triangle by a factor of three. Ta-da! There we go. And there are our new points, A, A prime, B prime, and C prime. You're ready for the test. Practice, practice, practice.